Welcome back to the channel, guys. Hope everybody's getting out, enjoying spring. Hopefully you got ice off all the way finally. Hopefully you guys, some of you guys in the south probably get on bed fishing already. I'm enjoying this hot, cold, hot, cold that Nebraska has to offer. We were on the open water, then it was super 40 mile an hour plus winds, then it was 30 degrees, now it's gonna be six degrees this weekend. I'm just ready for consistent temperatures. But that's not what we're here to talk about today, guys. It is the first week of the month, which means it's time for our great Hendrix unboxing. Let's dive in. Let's see what April has to bring. Also, my eyes might be able to see this here. Boom. These beautiful little tubes. Don't know sure if you can read it, but we got tungsten by Hendrix. Lowest price tungsten you'll find on the market. First one I got here, it's marked beautifully. This is the 1 8 ounce worm. Wait, we're pulling these guys out. You get a four pack, guys. Four pack. Beautiful no chip tungsten. Uh, there's black, there's red, there's flipping weights. I also picked up some of the 116th. I love this weight. Just enough weight to get it to the bottom, but not disrupt the worm's action. Also, a new bait that Hendrix dropped, one of his own. These are the four inch Hendrix Whippin' Swimmers. Boom. These guys here, they're a six pack. I got Silver Flash and I got Cajun. Cajun Gill currently is in my bag though. It's gonna be a beautiful one. And let me get this open. Oh, gotta tear it first, guys. Boom. Now, he got this in the anise, 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 however you guys like to pronounce it, scent. But check this one out. Beautiful standard color. I love the bend here. The only thing maybe for the future is maybe use a hair softer plastic. Um, the only reason is that'll give that a little more action, but I don't know what I'm talking about. I haven't fished these yet. Sorry, I'm critiquing a bit, I haven't fished. Love it though, I'm excited for it. I've got rigged up currently on a chatterbait. And then I'm probably gonna throw it on an underspin. Let me know what you guys think. But that's some of the fun stuff. Make sure you guys get your frogs too. We'll talk about that later. But you guys always know you gotta start off with the splash pack. First things first in the splash pack. Nice little card. If you guys didn't know, March was Autism Angler Awareness. So nice little card about the autism spectrum, about autism anglers. If you guys had a chance, I know Hendrix on his Instagram page, I also featured on mine, a few other guys featured on theirs. They were raising money for the awareness. Next year, guys, let's go bigger, let's do something. But if you can, check it out. Great, great organization. Love what they do. Who knows, maybe you got someone in your own life. Let's dive in more. We've got, first things first, we've got a card from one of our great buddies, Stump Thumper Bates. Oh boy. That makes me excited. I love his soft life. Go check him out, guys. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Okay. Oh, Cardoza lures. First things first, let's hit Cardoza. The Spanish flag is the color. Some stick baits from Cardoza here. Love this guy. Small company. That's the beautiful of Hendrix. You get small companies. This is fun. This is one of the fatter Senkos um, in terms of diameter. Um, Good part about that, less like a tear out. Good density, good texture to the to the plastic. Great stretch. It's a very subtle color. I love all the different color flake in there. Hope you guys can see that in the camera. There we go. This right here would be a perfect wacky rig stick. Great action, a little heavier. Could go weightless with this. Love that. So thanks Cardoza for hooking us up in the splash pack with that. But now guys, I'm looking at this beautiful combo here. RPM jigs, never heard of them, but we got these EWG net heads and kind of like a chartreuse color. These are a quarter ounce, so a little heavier. This is gonna get to the bottom. And guys, when I was out at the uh, Bassmaster World's Fishing Fair, uh, Bass Pro, excuse me, World's Fishing Fair, I was talking to one of the walleye guys in one of the seminars. He said, bass, walleye, anything, go deep with your net. He said the deeper water, everybody's scared to throw it in deep water. Throw it in deep water. He's fishing 20 plus feet of water. But to go with these net heads, paired up beautifully from Stump Thumper Baits, it's the Ned Thorn and Snot Rocket. Let me pull one out. You guys will see why it's a Snot Rocket here. Oh yeah. A little bit of salt or sugar. I forget what he uses. I, I get it why they do it. I wish they'd use a little bit more of an oil though. But... Check that out, guys. 
It's got that beautiful action, wiggles, nice. You see why it's called a thorn? Also, why it can be called the snot rocket? I mean, this thing looks like it just came right out. So I love, love, love that. So great combination, dirty water, clean water. I'm excited to throw it. I'm working on some of these presentations. I'm not a guy that normally throws Neds. And what I learned in those seminars was, gotta throw what you're not comfortable with. He wasn't either. He started throwing a Ned rig. Boom, started catching fish. So, without further ado, let's get into the main event. And guys, it's got some weight. I know it's not as big of a box as the takeover box, but it's got weight. Oh, oh man. All right, well, oh. I'm gonna pull this around before we spill it. Oh geez, we're throwing everything. We're throwing everything, guys. Oh no. Let's get that back in there. Oh man, I'm making a mess. There's just too much, it's falling out. All right, out in the top, we have a redesigned Hendrix car. I kinda like it, it's fun, it's fresh. Got the new logo at the top there. Got that on the hat, guys. But there is one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine things in this box. Unless I miscounted, but retails $57.95. Get yours today for $34.99. But use code part time 10, save yourself 10%. But enough about that. You guys, you guys are not here for the marketing. So, first things first. If you didn't get the splash pack, don't worry. Boom, right in the box. But hold on. I'm looking at these. These are also a quarter ounce. Oh, they're a little different. They are not EWG in the splash pack. We got EWG ones. So there is a little difference there. That's awesome to see. I love those little differences. Then also from RPM jigs, we got a three A ounce. Let me look at the card here because I don't know what kind of jig it is. I'm not a good jig guy. I'm learning. This is a, oh, it's an arc style jig, arky. Not sure what an Arky style jig is. And it's in a uh, risque shad is the color. Love, love, love that. That's a great color there. Going along, we do have from Zerwinski Lures. And I apologize, but I, I might have totally screwed that up, guys. But we have this very interesting looking spinner bait. I'm starting to love throwing spinner baits. And this is in a great blue color. Let's see, did they have what does he call this here? <laughs> I'm looking at the card, guys, and I suck at this. Uh, Cardo, something. Oh, it's it says, oh, CZ Lures. We've gotten stuff from CZ Lures. It's just a different logo. And that must be his last name, I'm guessing. Okay, that's why we hit the card. I love this. You get the Willow Blade, Colorado Blade. It's textured gold. Nice bluegill color there. Love that. I don't know if I'll throw a trailer on it. It looks like it's designed to puff up. I love that little puff to it. So I'm excited for that. Put that to the side here. Okay. So if you didn't get the splash pack, you got some more of the Cardo Cardoza Spanish, uh, Spanish flag sticks. You got the snot rockets. And then, ooh, guys, if you go check my Instagram. I had a couple teases of this. If you guys didn't see it, I'm gonna get this opened up here. This is a Hendrix original bait. So you, if you didn't get the box, you didn't get these, but these are soon to be on the site. Gave us a little bit of a sample pack and guys, I'm, I'm not talking about this packaging. Uh, I get, give them a hard time. I love Tyler over at Hendrix. I just can't open stuff. Oh, I'm gonna grab them both out. But these are the 3.25 inch whisker biscuits. These are a great pairing. I'm going to yell at him too. He did like some sugary salt thing too. Man, do oil. He knows that. Oh well. These are a great trailer. Uh, great trailer. I think I might pair these two up. Ooh, that looks sexy right there. But these are a great trailer bait. They're chunk. Get the tail. Throw on a jig. Chatter bait. You could throw it by itself. I'll have to figure out a way you could throw it by itself. But we'll get there. Now, there's a couple more baits. Like I said, I think I, think I said you got snot rocks, you got those. There is three more baits still, but let me tease the next company. Love these guys. They've been in a box before. Um, or was it a splash pack? I'm not 100% sure. I can't remember. But we did get from Active Catch one of his square bills. This is a hook size four, dies one to four foot. 
And let me pull this out. I've had a couple of those before. I've caught some good fish. Last year I caught a good bass on one. It was kind of a, I'm glad it's a different color too, but check that paint scheme out guys. Ooh. Hooks are sharp, careful of that. But check that out. I love the red eye. Love the blood splatter going through. Beautiful orange breast belly. Uh, crab, little perch, I don't know what you want to call this. I love it. It's a little translucent. I'm not sure if you guys can see that. But that is awesome. It's a great blank too. I've had zero issues with the way these blanks have swum. Swam, 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 swam. Uh, English is hard again, guys. But, whew, two more baits. We're still going. Now, these next two baits I was featuring all over my Instagram. TL and you guys, you need to get it. You need to get this month's box. First thing, from One Cast Fishing, we got a chatterbait. This is Ultimate PB&J. It's a 3 8 ounce bladed jig. Let me see how to get into this thing. There's no tear here. Guys, I need, I'm doing unboxings and I need to work on how to unbox stuff. Okay, some of you guys are cringe, but I'm gonna bite. All right, we're in. We're in. I don't know why it was sealed in, but I'm gonna put it right on the hook here. Be perfect chatterbait time. Interesting, so chatterbait with the hole. Have you guys worked any of those blades with the holes there? If so, let me know, but I'm excited to give this a try. Nice sharp hook. Let's check the bait keeper. Yep, bait keeper there. I prefer the one with a little bit of like the wire that digs in, but these don't work as bad as either. Nice little trick. If you want to stay, throw a little super glue, all good. But I love that skirt, nice PB and J color. Now, to go with it, from our boy over at Flippin' Steak Bait Company, this is a four inch swimmer shed, and it's a color match special edition, ultimate PB and J. It's meant to go with this chatter bait. Oh, ho, ho. Guys, I hope the camera can do this justice. Beautiful purple on top, like the jelly, you got the peanut butter, great separation of color. I love these kind of baits. Uh, it's kind of like the Yamiyoto, um, but I love how this gives, this gives extra action. If this sticks out too much, too little, you can always bring it in, take, a, take your scissors, cut, chew it off, bring this shorter, leave it long. You got plenty of adjustments, but let me see. Let me rig it up here real quick for you guys. If I can remember how to rig one of these up, there we go. First day on the job, guys. Ooh, I should have done the trick, but I didn't do the trick. Not too bad, though. It'll work for what I'm trying to show you. But check this combo out. This just looks beautiful. I'm gonna pull this back off, though. And then you know what, I'm gonna show you guys what I do. It's a simple thing. Maybe you guys know it, maybe you don't. But if you wanna work, figure out how to perfectly rig your bait, you take your jig, take your bait, hold it up next to each other. Go, okay, yep, I want, the, I want it to poke out right there. I put my fingers there. Then you run your hook through. And now you've got a good idea where that hook needs to poke through. My hard part is always just getting it centered on the back. Ooh, that was pretty spot on. Trick never fails me. Takes just one extra second to push that thing up on the bait keeper like that, straighten the bait out, and boom, you've got a perfectly laid jig. You want a little more hook, bring it up shallower. You want to let that thing stick down, but they're still going to be able to bite and hook on. This is getting rigged up and leave it like so. That is all the baits, guys. Let me know your favorite. Also, if you guys got a box, I was watching, I got any baits from the Hendrix website, make sure you guys enter. Check out our guy, Real Custom Art. Hashtag hooked on Hendrix. You post that onto your Instagram post with a fish, fish that in a bait that you caught from the Hendrix. I believe this is the Walton Fishing. He put it on a chatter bait. It's their uh, swim bait in the fire crop. Beautiful bass he caught. He won a mystery box just for posting. So buy some baits, go catch some fish, have fun post it you'll win some extras until next time guys you know the drill good luck on the water be safe